It's the latest health trend that everybody is talking about, CBD oil. Now, it comes from the cannabis plant, and many believe it can help with everything from anxiety and chronic pain to diabetes, even cancer. We're in the midst of a CBD oil boom with products popping up everywhere. Today, Dr. Sanjay Gupta is here to investigate what exactly is CBD oil, and does it live up to the hype? But first, I asked correspondent Marcia Abacampo to find out how big CBD has truly become. CBD. If you haven't heard of it yet, you probably will soon. The natural herb is taking the health world by storm, with sales of the new supplement expected to grow 700% in the next two years. Wow, you just see great review after great review. I mean, people seem to love this stuff. 4,000 reviews four and a half stars. Short for cannabidiol, CBD is a component of the cannabis plant. Yep, cannabis. But unlike marijuana, CBD does not contain any THC, the psychoactive part of the plant, so it doesn't get you high. Over the last few years, CBD has started popping up in everything from gummies to face cream to toothpaste. There are even CBD treats for your pet. So what does it do? Research has been limited, but proponents say CBD has all the benefits of medical marijuana without the intoxicating effects, helping with insomnia, pain management, and anxiety. There's a revolution, a, a whole movement happening now with plant-based wellness, which is our primary interest. Celebrating the power of all plants, which have not been properly represented. And the question everyone asks is, is it legal? Dr. Sanjay Gupta, CNN's medical correspondent, the chief one, and has reported on the latest research behind CBD. So if you know what, break this down for everybody. I'd like to take your thoughts on what it really is so people can get this into their heads. Well, you think about the cannabis plant, marijuana, it's called cannabis. Um, it really has lots of different ingredients, but two primary ones. One is THC. That's the stuff that's the recreational drug. It's what gets people high, gives them that euphoria. And there's CBD, which is cannabidiol. It's, it's uh, something that doesn't cause a psychoactive component. It's believed to be a medicine. It's been used as a medicine in decades past. And it's getting this resurgence, as you just heard. 